if it's bad for people, then we should strangle it in its crib right now. <laughs> right. And why just blow up the data centers? Like, I don't, why is that hard? If it's actually going to become what you just described, which is a threat to people, humanity, life, then we have a, a moral obligation to murder it immediately. And since it's not alive, we don't need to feel bad about that. Well, you could say the same about the atomic bomb, right? Yes, you could. And you could say that we have to develop it like Oppenheimer felt before the Nazis did. I love that. How'd that work? <laughs> How'd that work? Well, it... I love, by the way, that people on my side, I'll just say, I'll just admit it, on the right, you know, have spent the last 80 years defending dropping nuclear weapons on civilians. Like, are you joking? Right. That's just like prima facie evil. Yeah. If you can't, well, if we hadn't done that, then this, that, the other thing, that was actually a great savings life. No, it's wrong to drop nuclear weapons on people. And if you find yourself arguing that it's a good thing to drop nuclear weapons on people, then you are evil. Like it's, it's, not, a, it's not a tough one, right? It's right. not a hard call for you. It's not a hard call for me. 